Right, we're going to go over to exploring mode yet again to see if I can uh, explore a bit more of the ship. Or shall we try muse museum mod? Let's have a look. Let's have a look at this one. Though. No, sink mode, escape mode. No. Um, let's do the exploring mode yet again. Yeah, well, it's getting a bit late and I'm not thinking straight. Um, that's how we go, shall we? That one. Um, yes. Um, my long... I don't know if I... If you had a chance to read the... Uh, take a look at the other one. It was a bit chucked together. Um, but I do have a long lost ancestor called Mary Sloan who worked... Who people are saying... People are saying who worked on the Titanic. Alright, um, I also had an on, a long lost ancestor called Peter Sloan, who also people are saying worked on the Titanic. But what the ship that people are calling the Titanic are not the it's not the Titanic. It is the Olympic. The two ships, right, who at one time started their life as not being identical in any little way at all. But when the Olympic got uh, uh, hit, oh, is it a, a Navy warship in Southampton waters, uh, she was pretty damaged. Uh, she got actually got pretty damaged, so she had to get towed back to Southampton dock, to our dock, and um, we uh, Strengthened, strengthened up so she can then set her sails back to um, Belfast where she was built. Right. While she was in Belfast, um, her sister ship, the Titanic, was, was not yet completed. Um, so they uh, all works on the Titanic stopped, so the, the work, so, oh, hang on, well, hey, I'm happy, <laughs> all right, well, all right, all right, this is, yeah, so you could, could, all the works on the Titanic got stopped, so like all, all the efforts and the workforce can go into repairing the Olympic. Then they realised that the Olympic was going to cost way too much money for them to repair. So they decided not to repair the Olympic to just strengthen her, strengthen her a bit more, but like a big sort of iron boulder thing to strengthen her a bit more. Um, change the, the the look of the Titanic, uh, the look of the Olympic, right? To make the Olympic look so so identical to the Titanic, right? So the Titanic and the Olympic then became. Um, sister ships, right? Um, yeah, it, they became sister ships, and uh, ah, now I know where I am. Yeah, they can become sister ships. Um, I stand here while I'm talking to you because I'm actually making it. What's in there actually? Oh, there's like a green light and the window. Red light. And there they are again there. What does the blue, red light and the green light actually stand for? Mm, don't I? Um, stop and go, probably. 
So if we can now find the steering part where the captain stands, right? Surely we can find the the engine room. Hey, right? Hey. <laughs> um, yeah, you might see me looking over there before because it's actually quite. It's actually pretty hard for me to do. So I've got another monitor there, right? Another monitor here, and it's actually got my camera on that cam on that screen, so I can see that I'm recording, right? But I've got the game on this monitor here, right? So um, <laughs> yeah, I'm going to start doing more. Gameplay videos like this, and I think it's just so cool. Right? Um, yeah. Oh my god! Oh my god. What was I doing? What was I thinking? That's it. The Olympic and the Titanic then became start becoming more identical, becoming twin ship twin ships. Right? But what they didn't think about is see that bit there, right? They didn't re in that we think tension this up because on one of the ships, and if you want to look at more, it's all on my YouTube channel for the for the Titanic history. I've got a Facebook page, I've got a Facebook page and a YouTube channel called the Titanic History. Right, look it up on there. It might be easier to find the YouTube channel going through the Facebook page. Look up on that, and it would tell me you're on there. That on the on the two ships, the Titanic and the Olympic, that that bit there. Right on one ship, it was completely straight, like this ship, right? Um, and on the other ship, it wasn't straight, right? So, um, but here you go. It's the big steering wheel. It is actually quite a big steering wheel. Um, but yeah, the, the um, it's got more evidence of the Titanic being switched than um, it brought more evidence of the, the, the evidence, it's got more evidence to face that the two ships have was switched um, than it has to face that the ships what have not been switched. So I'm actually pretty sure. And I would actually um, be um, amazed if anyone can face and can actually hand me uh, con any concrete evidence to say if the ship has been switched, the ships have been switched, or no ships haven't been switched. Right? If they haven't been switched, please comment below. Give me uh, solid facts on the fact that they have not been switched. If they uh, or they have been faxed, uh, uh, switched, please comment below telling me solid facts that um, that the ship's been switched. I want to know if, the, if, you got, if you guys think that the ship's been switched or the ship hasn't been switched. Right? Comment it in the section below. That'd be a big, big help. Big, that'd be cool to hear, to hear your views on that. And um, comment below if you think they have or have it. That'd be big, right? Come on, it's I've got to be. I get I've got to bring this the truth out. I think I have got to be the one, as well as long as the others who've done documentary videos of the 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 um. Uh, what's it called? The documentary video of the uh, Ford theory of the two ships being switched, right? Um, for sure, insurance reasons. This here, hang on. Door to real house is locked. Uh, the key at the the key at the future at the future. Futures office, or it's called the Futures office. Where's, where's the Futures office? I need to get into that there. Ooh. I need to get in there. I want to get in there. 
<laughs> Who? Where's the future? Where's that place, right? Where's the, where's, I need to find this office here, right? So, I wonder where that could be. Um, could it be down there? No. Let's go down there, shall we? Whee! Um, could it be down here? I don't know. I don't know, but let's have a look. I'm not gonna give it up. Oh, nice music. Who would have a dance? Wee hee hee, dancey, dancey, dancey. <laughs> well, right. oh, let's look in this minute, shall we? Look. What's that noise? Sounds like tea's done. Um. Bit gets, gets to the dining room. T sounds like it's done. Um. Uh, okay. Oh, I wonder if I'm in there. <laughs> I am the only. Sh uh, oh, look, I stand the only sh uh, person on this ship. I'm up. Does that mean I'm the captain? Please don't say I'm the captain. I thought it'd be the one, one that. Well, that's blocked. So I, it's not up there. I can't get up there. What's in there? Um, another thing is, uh, if you look at, it will say this is this is all panny on one of the ships. All this promenade here, on one of them is uh, some. And one of it is all closed in, and some of it was actually not. Look at the ships, all right? Before and after, they done the work to make them look so alike. They could be, then became the two ships, then the Olympic and the Titanic became twins because the Olympic right, was so different at one time. All right, you can even tell the differences right the way down to do a pillar blade, or it's on the back because the Olympic. Actually, blew, uh, broke um, broke her propeller blade twice, twice, all right, um, and the also you can tell the between the differences of the um, what's it called it um. Um, what do you call it? Uh, <laughs> um, um, how are you there? I can't remember what I'm saying now. What was it? Um, yeah, the Titanic um, quite generously gave the Olympic one of her appellate blades. Her the Titanic's number, right? And again, if you would like to know the number of the appellate blade of the Titanic's num the Titanic's number and the appellate blade with the Titanic's number on it, look me up on YouTube. Look for up. Uh, look up for. Um, Titanic history, right? I have got um, the GSS videos. Okay, yeah, up I'm um, GSS videos. I'm Glenn Samson from GSS videos, right? I'm Glenn, Glenn Samson from GSS videos, but I also have a YouTube channel for the called the um, Titanic history, right? Um, but I also link into the section, the comment section below in the, in the description. So you can go over to it that way. Um, I even look, comment, um, put the link to the Facebook page, um, Titanic History, on that in the in the description as well as my GSS Facebook page, my GSS um, Twitter uh, channel. Right. So you can tweet me, you can message me on either 
Titanic history, or you can miss me on GSS videos. Whatever you, it I will be, uh, I will comment, message you, because if I'm not on the computer, I've got Twitter on here, and I've got Twitter on, I've got Twitter on here, and I've also got a app from Facebook page uh, to keep up to date with my Facebook pages, right? So I've got, I've got loads, right? I've got loads, right? Um, oh, I can't go in there, I've got to go, hang on. And there, um, B deck, B deck, B deck, B deck, B deck, um, an itchy face, um. Where is that bead? Where's that? Well, uh, we started off here, so could it be down there? Mm, no, it's C deck here. Oh, hang on. Yeah, it, there it is. We found the office. So, okay, let's have a look. Oops, what's that say there? K2. Whoopsie daisy. Um, key. So, how am I going to pick up? Pick. How do I get the key? Um, oh, oh, I've got to pick up one of those keys somehow to that real house. How? Oopsie daisy. <laughs> Keep looking there for that. Um, wait, what happened there? Oh my god, what happened there? Okay. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, days. All right, we're going to do something else. Oh, we got where we at? Oh my God, we got the tram. All right. Second class entrance. So we're the second class entrance, right?
there it is. 